Hi guys, it's Mr. Holding. Um, this video is uh, aimed at an introductory um, explanation of DNA and its organisation. So what is DNA? Um, what are chromosomes, genes and how they all relate to um, cells and where they fit? DNA is the instruction manual for how to build life. From animals to plants to humans, it defines us all. Information is stored in DNA using four types of molecules which come in pairs. We have billions of these pairs. DNA folds itself into paired packages called chromosomes, which are stored in the nucleus of cells. Each species has a different number of chromosomes. Humans have 46 chromosomes, which contain our genes. Genes act as instructions for molecules called proteins. So basically what you would have said, what you would have seen then is a brief explanation of that. But in summary, DNA is the instruction manual for how we build life. Okay, They tell cells what to do, what the type of cells they need to develop into, all those types of things. All right, And all this information is stored in, D in DNA using four types of molecules, um, which we refer to as bases, um, A, T, C and G. We'll learn about that a bit more later. Um, DNA folds himself into packages called chromosomes, and it's a term you've probably heard from before, and those chromosomes um, are stored inside the nucleus of every cell in a living organism. So every single cell in your body has a full set of chromosomes. Um, and in these chromosomes, it contains what's referred to as our genes, which are instruction for molecules called proteins, and proteins are what makes up our body. In humans, genes vary in size, from a few hundred DNA bases to more than two million bases, and we have an estimated 20,000 to 25,000 of these genes passed during reproduction. Each person has two copies of each gene, one inherited from each parent, and most genes are the same in all people except for a small number of genes being slightly different. These small differences contribute to each person's unique physical characteristics, varying from height, color, and personality traits. Some While we share 98% of our DNA with bonobos and chimpanzees, we don't quite look alike because that 2% equals thousands and thousands of different genes. And while all humans share over 99% of our DNA with each other, what we don't share is what makes us unique in our own way. Summary, basically, um, if we look at DNA, DNA is, is what we refer to as the building block of life. It sends the messages of what to do, what cells should be. So DNA... Um, gets packaged up, it forms in what's called chromosomes in humans, 46 of them, which is 23 pairs. On each chromosome, there's a series all the way up and down called genes, and these genes are instructions basically to build proteins. So, and proteins are what makes up our body, so they make up do individual things, hormones, cells, all those types of stuff. So DNA forms chromosomes, chromosomes have genes on them, and genes produce our proteins.